Hello everybody and welcome to another walkthrough on the channel. Welcome back. In the last one we worked on getting ourselves the boat as you can see right there. In the previous episodes before that we uh, worked on the base here. And also a little bit on the live stream because a save file got corrupted. So one of the walkthroughs, the second one I believe, we activated this lighthouse here when we uh, solved the puzzle. And we talked to the guy Shu over here and he told us to go uh, build a boat and travel to the village. And the village is on the map over here. So we have to sail that way. Now the lighthouse is pointing towards there. So right down there in the middle is what it looks like. As you can see there's a tiny little island there. And that is supposedly the um, the cage for the titan that we have to trap. That's going to be very interesting. We're going to have to trap a titan soon. And I did notice that there was one more option to talk about with him. The Hermit and the Kong. I heard stories of ancient relics of great power. These power Kongs are able to impact the world around them and even control the titans. We will need a magical conch to summon the titan into the titan cage. I don't have much else but a person who might be able to help find the conch. There is a hermit on this island that knows everything about the history of the island. Like I know about the titans and their ruins. Go seek him out. See if you can find the location for the magic conch. Well, uh, come back once you have it. And we have more work to do. Alright, we will trap a titan yet. Now, I already know there's a trader right over here. If we go down to the beach, we'll find him. Uh, hello there, mister. Are you the person I have to talk to? Mission. Legend of the Kong. Hmm, who are you? Shu sent you, huh? Well, what do you want? Looking for a magical Kong in the graveyard? Well, I can't say I know much about it, but there is an ancient graveyard on the island. Lots of islands have them. Be ca I would be careful if I were you. The water does strange things to things underground. I heard those golems used to be fish. Ooh, interesting. Alright, I think I already know where this is. I already saw some sort of a graveyard when I was roaming around here. Yeah, there it is. It's right behind his house. Okay, so is this it? Can I, uh, oh yeah, I can use the graveyard ruins. Reading this doesn't do anything. Maybe that's not implemented yet. Alright, let's use this one though. But oh, there it is. Gunk of the Turtle Titan. When used, um, when used will summon the Turtle Titan to fight you. Must be near an active titan cage area to work. Oh yeah, there we go. We found it. Yes. Well, that's something. If I were you, I'd put that back. Instruction follows any who test the ancients and their creations. Right. Well, I'm not going to put it back. I'm going to put it in my chest somewhere. Now let's go and talk to uh, Shu. Maybe he knows more about it. Okay, well, Shu doesn't really seem to know much more. So that is it for that bit. We have that. Now we can theoretically summon the Turtle Titan in the cage, which is supposed to be over there. I want to check it out. I want to go there and see what we're dealing with. I will not try to activate it just yet because I have no idea how to fight it. So we're just going to put it right over here in the crate where it's safe all right it is time to go and explore with our sailboat here let's jump on it and let's first try and go to that titan cage see what we're dealing with there we go control the boat raise the sail and let's go ah and there we go Looks like we made it to the Titan Cage, Titan Gate ruins. There we go. All right, let's get off the boat. Let's see what we're dealing with here. All right, so it looks exactly the same as the one on the island. 
maybe that will change in the future because it is still an early access game of course and looks like we have to put in a second relic in here because we did need a second relic that's what Chu told us and we had to find that at the uh, at the village which i believe is right over there actually or at least we had to find ourselves a map that goes towards the titan relic so let's go towards that village now we are already halfway there anyway so we might as well let's see we have everything with us we have tools we have bow and arrow i have a sword on me and we have plenty of food and water so we should be good to go all right looks like we made it to the village over here let's put our boat right there let's stop it and let's go ahead and explore shall we looks like it's just another pine island just like the one we started in oh nice there's some free food right there awesome ah beautiful i can already see a lot of people over there with a lot of trading signs above their head oh mission signs as well i see hello there sir uh missions let's see you want me to catch some fish huh well, i don't really feel like it how about you titan relic there we go are you looking for the titan relic treasure map you should check with our cartographer they might know more about it okay if you're going to attack the titan you will need more than the average weapons go out onto the island and locate the hunter they will teach you about the crystal weapons in their use all right cool thank you and what do you sell sir boat repair kits crab shells and red sea anemone all right good to know look at that that's a mighty tower and what do you have hello hello there's a lot of people here shop bone chicken feather fine sand green jelly skin oh i didn't even know you could buy those wow that's awesome that's useful good to know oh you can buy uh, meals here as well that's real good we have another mission over here free bone armor all right might do that at some point and we have a uh, oh a forge with some nails and iron ore steel a cannon blueprint boat class chaser blueprint and a traveler blueprint wow okay we can get a much better boat then awesome and what about you sir spencer hello oh looks like you are the person we were looking for we need 26 shards uh oh yeah we don't have that okay let's see if we can sell something luckily we have plenty of food with us so we can easily sell that there we go 30 shards buy the map okay where do we have to go for the second relic let's see unseal it oh we have to go back to the first island looks like all right let's go there or actually before we go there we had to find this hunter and i believe he is right over there i can see a little house in the distance there oh what a beautiful morning hello sir are you the hunter i'm looking for hello there david mission please hmm crystal creatures what do you want ah so you be wanting to put down those poor things eh them boars have drank too much crystal water it's changed them more powerful more aggressive more dangerous uh, than the people to the people in the village it takes more than just your everyday weapons to take them down you need crystal weapons here are a few for you to use you're gonna need a few more of them regular arrows to finish them off once they have their shields gone bring me back some tusks and oh yeah if you ever run out here's a blueprint to make them crystal arrows nice make make it five tusks okay so there are special boars on this island i haven't seen any walking around yet i mean we haven't really explored too much all right do we have okay we have special arrows now awesome and we have the blueprint for them all right cool all right let's get my bow and uh, let, let's hunt i guess i guess we can press number five on our keyboard here and switch to yeah we can switch to the blue arrows so apparently we have to use the blue arrows first on a boar that with uh with blue tusks or something or a blue shield and then we can shoot it with regular arrows or i suppose use the sword 
All right, let's find myself that boar. Oh, we finally found one. Wow. They are very uncommon, it seems. I've been running around the whole map here. Um, like we start, we started here with the hunter, and I've been running around all this, all of this area here, and didn't find any of them. All right, but here's our first victim. Let's go get it. All right, so first we have to shoot a arrow. Let's see. Shoot an arrow at him. Stay still, sir. Number one. Number two. And then we can get our sword and just smack him. Oh, nice. Don't run away, sir. Don't you run away. You'll never get away from me. Nice. Well done. Looks like we can get our arrows back, which is really nice. Oh, we get some shards as well. Cool. And we have two tusks. Okay. Well, hopefully we can find another one because we needed five. Let's go and uh, look for some more. Oh, I can see another few in the distance. Beautiful. All right. So we're really lucky. Or I, or I guess we were a little bit unlucky not finding them before. All right. Let's shoot this boy. Hello, sir. One two and switch to the weapon <laughs> he doesn't really seem to care when you shoot at him and after a few seconds of running they don't really care much whoa wow that was an explosion of stuff awesome all right how many tusks do we have four tusks we're almost there one more one more boar and boar number three hello hello there we go one and six swings there we go all right we got our arrows back we got all the tusks we even have one extra that's awesome i'm not sure if those tusks are useful for anything else um i haven't seen any recipe uh haven't seen any recipe needing those tusks but maybe in the future they will be added i wonder what they will be uh, able to do maybe special armor or special weapons who knows hello there mr hunter we have your tusks. Did you get them? Yes, we got them. Them tusks will do nicely. Thank you. All right, nothing else. If you're looking to know more about the crystal weapons, you should go and see the person who taught me. He used to be a breakwater, master of the seas. He lives out on his own on a small island. I'll mark the last place I recall him being on on your map. You might even be able to get you something for on your boat. Sounds cool, huh? Yeah, sounds cool indeed. Thank you very much, Mr. Uh, Mr. Hunter, sir. I'll be on my way to the second relic. All right, and back towards the first island we go. But before we go back to the first island, I realize we need a shovel probably to uh, dig up the treasure just like the first time. But yeah, luckily this island is uh, on our way back to the first one. Let's quickly get our shovel and I will see you guys all on the first island. All right, let's see. Where is the treasure? Let's take a look at that map again. It is almost where I am right now. Looks like right now I'm like somewhere around there on this little bit of the island. And it is supposed to be right there. Not too far out. Hopefully it's not underwater this time of day. Looks like it might be. So we might have to wait a little bit before we can actually dig it up. Oh yeah, there it is. Alright, I'm lucky. The water is not too high up. Let's first get rid of this crab here. Because you will definitely go ahead and attack me once I start shoveling. Let's get the shovel ready. And let's dig for the second relic. Beautiful. Second Titan Relic. Awesome. This has been quite an adventure. First we went over to the cage. Where we can apparently summon the Turtle Titan. Uh, of course we got the, uh, the little shell for it to summon it. We went over to the village as well. And got ourselves some uh, shiny new weaponry. Some new blue crystal arrows. We learned of his person somewhere on the map. Let's take a look actually if we can see where he is. All the way over there looks like. Wow, that's really far away. 
That person is supposedly a uh, breakwater, which apparently he knows a lot about the crystals and everything. So he's going to teach us things about ways to defend ourselves. And I believe the hunter said something about crystal weapons, which is going to be awesome. I can't wait to go there. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys there in the next walkthrough. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and want to see more. I also do guides on the channel and live streams for breakwaters. So if you don't want to miss out on any of that content, then uh, you know what to do. Thanks so much for watching again. And I hope to see you all next time.